Okay, just by typing, I've already ruined some people's days in Rain on Your Parade. It's a very simple game, it looks like, where you are a cloud, and you ruin people's days by raining on them. Would you look at that? What happens if you rain on the, on the bush? Nothing. On the barbecue? Get extinguished. On the garbage can? Get stinky. On the streetlight? Get shorted out. Okay, let's, let's start the game up here. I've heard very good things. This came out like a week ago, I think. Grandpa, Grandpa, tell me a story. A story? Hmm, have I told you about the cloud I met once? That sounds boring. Ha ha ha. Oh, trust me, clouds are never boring. Humph. A cloud can fly anywhere it wants. It can rain on anything. Um, ha ha, when you grow up, you will understand the joy of... Messing up other people's stuff. All right, so what's this cloud do? Let me put my glasses on. Can I talk my S again? Isaac and his mother lived alone in a house on a hill. Once upon a time, there was a small cloud with a big dream. He dreams of other happy clouds being near him. To find a place of old folk tales where clouds can roam free. The Pacific Northwest. And rain on anything they want at any time. So it packed its bags, whatever bags a cloud might have, and set on a world-trotting journey. To find the mystical, the fabled, the legendary. I knew it. I was going to say Seattle. It's known as a rainy city. Seattle, what the electric city? A star means the objective is needed to beat the level. Soak bride and groom and soak all humans. Okay, we're a cloud. So, I mean, like, we it's Pokemon Snap. We could soak them as she walks up. Or we got to do it before she walks up because this is more embarrassing for her. If we waited until they were at the altar, it could have been, like, a nice moment for them. Um, they, they could have bonded over it, and as a, as a cloud, I can't have that happening. We have knocked over all chairs. Would you believe that? Okay. Let's short out the electricity. I, I think we might have just killed a person. Okay. I mean, I got, I got no problems here. We'll just soak all the humans. We've soaked the bride and the groom. Couple people have made it without being touched. That was too easy. We also got a secret objective. Okay, question marks. Cloudy, cloudy, help. I might just be a dumpster, but these humans keep setting me on fire. Can you please put out all the fires and teach them a lesson? In return, I promise to take some cool photos of you in action with the photo mode. Check out the prompt on your screen when it appears. Okay, put out all the fires, soak all the humans. Okay, well, like, some of the humans are on fire. Like, this is messed up, dude. What? Photo mode. <laughs> Take a cool photo, tweet it at us. That's all right, I wouldn't worry about it. All right. Right now, we're doing a lot of just, you know, painting the screen with our, with our rain. It's going to get more complex. I've seen I've seen some footage, I've seen some reviews and previews. Just give it a second to breathe, I promise you. Boo! What happened? Oh, everybody died probably, huh? Okay, well let, let's stop the fire from spreading. Put the human out. Bro, you're spreading too much fire, man. Maybe, maybe somebody died? I think we got it. We, we put out all the fires. Done. Easy enough. Oh, you have limited water! Yeah! Okay, the bar on the right side of the screen. Sorry, on this ultra-wide monitor, sometimes it's hard to see the whole screen simultaneously. Oh, ho, oh, who's that I see? A young cloud? Who am I? Why, I'm Papa Cloud. A cloud as old as time. Yes, I was there when the first memes were invented. Oh, those silly badgers. <laughs> mushroom, mushroom. 
Okay, Boom Cloud. I hope you will listen to my words of wisdom. As you progress through the world, you will get the opportunity to invest in VTSAX uh, broad-based index fund tracking the entire American market. How does a cloud wear a hat, you might wonder? Why, simply by entering the cloud house. Go on, give it a try. The cloud house. Customized cloud. I mean, it's pretty classy. I will be a uh, purple rain cloud. That sounds nice. Ho Borvat's homely abode. It's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Yeah, th you're right. This is dust too, man. Protect the bomb. It actually is dust too. Help it go boom boom. This is bomb side B. Hey, hey, hey! They're coming! They're coming! Short ramp! What happens if you rain on the boxes? They turn green? How about that? What happens if you rain on the pots? You're not gonna make it, dude. Get bodied? How long is the timer here? This is too much. Okay, you know what? If it's gotta be done, it's gotta be done. Hang out close to the bomb. Look, I thought this game was supposed to be five on five. It's not fair. CT's stacked, man. They got too many people. Oh, no. Oh, no. They're doing little diffuses. Okay, that level... Too easy. Unbalanced teams. Who would win? One cloud or 100 Unatco agents? Cloudy, cloudy, help. Those humans took away all the trees. You need to help us. Oh, who am I? I am Froggy, of course. Back in the 90s, I was in a very famous video game. Don't act like you don't know. Ribbit. Hopping across a road, avoiding cars like there's no tomorrow. Just frogging around. He jumps in the water, splish, splash. Please, grow us a beautiful garden, I beg you, but spare the children's. They don't know any better. Ribbit? Okay. Grow a garden, do not soak any humans. Soak all lamps. Okay. We can replenish our water at the water supply. If we were to grow a beautiful garden, it's just that simple. You just... You just rain on the grass. Oh no, is my planet coaster, uh... My planet coaster decor. Soak all the lamps, that's, that's no problem whatsoever. Please rotate the trees. Mother Nature does not have a rotate button. Ergo, I do not have a rotate button either. Please move. Please move, child. All lamps, consider yourself soaked. Haha! <laughs> Soaker! Thanks for the rain. Now we're talking. I'd like to use glowing hourglass, please. I don't know what I did, but we, we accomplished some kind of bonus objective, at least. This is not a garden. It's like a forest. Life's a garden. Dig it. Joe Dirt. Oh, hello, Cloudy. I am Buggy the Bug, and I was put here by the developers to tell you they care about your feedback. So if you encounter any bugs, please let them know, and they will work extra hard to fix them. That's it. That's my whole purpose. All right. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's self-aware. It's humorous. It's they're, they're, they're aware of what they're doing. Okay, Tony Hawk's school level. Oh, hello there, little Cloud. I'm just your friendly neighborhood grandma. Every story needs one. I'm here to tell you about the magical exit sign. When you complete all the required objectives, it will light up. You can end the level by hovering above it. This way, if you do not want to complete the extra objectives, you can leave early. No one will be upset. Just remember to have fun. Anyways, I will let you go now. Surely such a well-mannered cloud like yourself wouldn't be up to any silly pranks in me. A respectable grandma wouldn't just stand and watch, reminiscing about my own youthful days in school hijinks. Well, here's one piece of feedback. Don't put the worm and the grandma back-to-back -back in the dialogue. It's, it's 
too much for a, a Zoomer such as myself. Okay, explode the chemistry set, wake up the sleeping teacher, and overflow a volcano. Okay. Wake up the sleeping teacher. Yo, now we're talking. You can replenish your water from the lab sinks. This is a big level, man. What are you? I, I have acid water. I have blood water? I got regular old water. Okay. Sleeping teacher. I love cloud. Really? Honestly, he do see... I thought the game crashed on me. <laughs> it was actually just OneDrive telling me I wasn't signed in. Yellow plus blue equals death. Okay, so we could we could kill a human being if we wanted to. Will it boil? Watch and find out. What do you think? My very original idea. Okay, hold on. No, no, no. We don't. We don't want yellow and blue. We want. Uh, we want red. And then we're gonna make the volcano erupt. Mission accomplished. We do want yellow and blue. No, 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 no. Can you can you mix them up? Like, can I go a little red, then like, little? No. Okay. Oh, sleeping teacher. Hey, uh, I just, I don't, I just want to wake him up. I don't need to, we don't need to rain on him. Just wake him up. Oh, but all the kids are having such a great time on their cell phones. I don't want to, like, fry his laptop. Maybe we can just rain next to him? Ah, whatever. There you go. He do be awake. And then break the chemistry set? Whoops. <laughs> You know what? Just give me some of this acid. Oh, sorry, kid. Yellow, yellow plus blue equals death. Maybe I overfilled it? Probably overfilled it. That's my guess. That's not blue? What are you talking That's blue, baby. I don't think blue is normal water. Yo, this guy runs a tight ship. Okay, you might be right. Normal water isn't blue? Okay, you have, you have some blueberry Pepsi for me? It's in the bottom left of the chem lab. All right, thank you, thank you. Couldn't have done it without you? If you'll excuse me, please. Oh, dark blue. Okay, kids, back up, back away. Back away. Soak all backpacks. Chase art kids into classroom at the end of the hall. Soak. Windows is constantly improving. You know what? How about another time? How, how about like don't do the Windows update like literally right now? Just throwing that out there. <laughs> All right, soak all backpacks, chase art kids into the hallway. All backpacks will be soaked. You know me, I'm a, I'm a min-max Marty. I'm a 100% I'm a uh, sort of guy. There's a backpack. Consider yourself soaked. There's a backpack. Sorry, sorry. Dude, this kid, he's, he's mad, but he's still writing the exam. <coughs> Pardon me. Okay, we, no, not red water. I see no backpacks. Oh, if you'll excuse me. I see a backpack. There's three of six backpacks. Four of six backpacks. Five of six backpacks. Dude, this is just like Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. That's a car, not a backpack. Chase the art kids to the end of the hall. 
Six of six backpacks? No? Five of six backpacks? Come on. There's got to be one in here. There's another one in the quiet room. <sighs> That's what you get. You mess with me, your, your friend gets rained on. Okay, art kids. I have enough water. Get ready to be chased to the end of the hall. Hey, hey! Look at this. You get what you freaking deserve. <laughs> what? What? Chase the into the classroom at the end of the hall. What the heck? He's stuck on the locker. Yeah, 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 yeah. Break down the door. We've done it. We've disrupted the class. And finish the level. <laughs> Maybe now they can afford a roof for their school. Rack up as many points as you can before you run out of water. Okay. Check this out. Step one. Just bump this stuff off the walls. There you go. That's 400 points. Excuse me? Excuse there we go. Uh, okay, I was thinking that maybe it might kill them. Hey, oh, you're thirsty, huh? Wanna take a drink of... Take a drink of this. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. Nice slow dance. What if instead you got uh, rained on or something? Hey, look at that. Electricity, baby. Times three multiplier. I mean... I didn't know, like... I was the best player of the game of all time or something. I guess we got a times 20 multiplier. Personally, I thought I was mostly just holding the... Holding the button down. There's no way. How are we supposed to compete with Spirit Buddy TTV? It's like $90,000 worth of damage. Amazon Marketplace. Burn it all. Okay. So it's already burning. But what if we hit this Tomahawk missile? Nothing. What if we hit the Half-Life logo? What if... We hit the forklift and it shorts out and crashes into... What if we hit the to Toxic Sludge? Okay. It's very simple. No, no, no. We don't want water. We want oil. And then the oil... Spreads to the missiles. The missiles shoot the explosive barrels. Or the door. Okay, they explode that sweet little car over there. Keep it going. Blo what happens, do you, do you think, if you blow up the Half-Life here? G-Man's coming out. It's just that easy. Oh, sorry, I'm, I'm now raining rain on you, my mistake. We have not burned everything, huh? Mr. Freeman, I presume? It's not the Half-Life logo, it's just a Lambda? If you were to describe the Half-Life logo, how would you describe it? I would describe it as a Lambda, personally. It has a circle. Oh, only the... You're talking about the collector's edition? Destroy the yellow wheat, corrode all vehicles, soak all humans, scare off all crows. Okay. Destroy the yellow wheat. Corrode all vehicles. Okay. Corrosion. Very simple. Just water plus time. Very satisfying sound. Destroy the yellow wheat. Yeah, yeah, take that! Take a little bit of the life-giving universal solvent.
How do you feel about that? Uh, grape jelly? Hmm. Break the water tower. I love cloud. I mean, if you love the cloud, I'm gonna, I'm happy to, I'm happy to help. I'm also happy to grow some strawberry cough over here. Help him out? Why not, right? Farming simulator. Yeah, baby. Frick. Farming Simulator Thursday, baby. <sighs> Pollution. Okay, I've gone nuclear. All yellow wheat will be destroyed. It's called acid rain. Remember Tutty Farming Sim? No joke. I, I thought that... Uh, I've, I've been itching for something similar to Tutty Farming Sim. If we could find something that worked, it would, it would be a dream come true. We'd probably only do it for like a couple of days, but... There's just something about uh, just, just you and your lads hanging out on a farm. Get scared. Get scared. Get scared? Corrode all vehicles. I'm missing a vehicle somewhere, man. Does a windmill count as a vehicle? Are you fully corroded or are you just like... Are you just annoyed? For a dollar, name a vehicle. Are you a vehicle? Oh, sorry, we're, we're water again? My mistake. There was a car. Oh, those are vehicles now? Get out of here. Okay, we need one more bird. I'm starting to pick it up. It's, it's less like Hitman. Although I can see that. It's more like kind of Scribblenauts meets Where's Waldo. Get bodied. Yeah, bro. I destroyed your wheat. You got a problem? This has got to be a bonus objective. Like, grow all corn. Great sound. It sounds like popcorn, man. Is this how popcorn's made? No. Where's the kernels? Well, I feel pretty tricked. I've, I've grown all the corn. Excuse me. Excuse me, child. I could see, uh, I could see the goose game comparison as well. Dude, what a ripoff. It's all done, right? Like, this is like my worst nightmare for content. I think they're all done. Okay, give me the acid again. Bottom, top, bottom left, top left. One more bot. You're right, there was one more in the bottom there. What a rip, dude. Okay, the other farm has not been finished either. Fair enough. Okay, I'm not gonna rain acid down on you. I just need, like, there's supposed to be, like, a car or something around? What if we rain down acid on the water tower? Okay, look, I let's not mess with it. Oh, no! Oh, yes? Let's do it. It, it could be fun. <laughs> car is on the bottom right. Well, well, well. They've been hiding vehicles of the state over here. And then soak all humans. I mean, dude, we're gonna get like maximum decor. I give my, uh, I can give my cloud Heelys. Get soaked. You gotta take offense from like a tactical raindrop, right? Like if it was raining and you got wet, you just go, what do you expect? If it's not raining, and you get soaked out of nowhere... You wanna tell- you wanna make God laugh? Tell him your plans. Easiest wins of my life, man. 
This time is personal. This is ice cream. No, that's a cereal, man. Oh, what the heck? Josh played this a few days ago? I got beaten to an indie game by Josh? Wait a minute. So cloudy just rains on anyone they want and no one stops them? Oh, or of course not. You see, you just haven't met Cloudy's nemesis. Silver iodide shot up in fireworks used by the Chinese government to make sure it didn't rain before the opening ceremonies of the 2008 Beijing Olympics. It's called cloud seeding. This is getting interesting. Yes, exactly. There was one man who absolutely hated clouds. The mean, old, dastardly... Dr. Dry Spell. I tell you, he was one angry son of a angry grouch. What happened next? I hate this guy. What is that which I see? A stupid cloud approaching me? Do you not know you are my bane? If you're confused, I shall explain. Caught in rain once when I was eight, from hence was born all my hate. When I was twelve, I took a bath which only further fueled my wrath. He's this MF spitting. I said no more, I won't be wet, no more rain, no more sweat. I'm Dr. Dryspell, a villainous cause, and you have fallen into my paws. This is where you meet your doom, turrets go, boom, boom, boom. How about that? Get through the canyon and soak the generator, do not run out of water, don't get hit. I am a, a genius. This is gaming. My god. Alt F4, eat your heart out, man. Okay, I... End level. Retry. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's embarrassing. Did you like playing Alt F4? No joke, I, uh... I just was on Steam the other day, looking for games similar to Alt F4. My search remains fruitless, but one day. One day we'll figure it out. It just, that game had an, I got hit. That game had an incredible vibe. You know what, I'm moving on. <laughs> you should try Paunch. Isn't that the free-to-play one-on-one fighting game where you throw rocks at each other? When fan What fantastic progress you are making, young cloud. Ho, 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 one day you will be as big as me. Did you know that some clouds have the power of thunder? Is it possible to learn this power, you might ask? Why, yes, you can purchase new powers with cloud bucks, and you can obtain cloud bucks by trading in thunder coins. And thunder coins come in packs of 12 you can purchase for just ho, 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 just kidding. There are no currencies or microtransactions here. You unlock things simply by playing the game. What a concept. Okay, I get it. You're not like other games. You're a cool game. You unlocked Thunder Ability. Try it now. That's spooky. This looks like where Homer Simpson um, presented his idea for what the nuclear power plant should look like. And it was just the existing power plant, but with some speed fins on the side of the cooling tower. Spoopy Forest Road. Soak all humans. What if it's... Oh, they got umbrellas. So you gotta, you gotta get rid of their umbrella first, and then hit them with one of those. And people say I'm bad at puzzles. Hey, get out of there. He's so good. It's a great episode, the grimy episode. Cloudy, cloudy, help. This is the pond where I grew up. The pond where I had my first crush and bought my first Nintendo Switch. <laughs> and now these humans, they are invading our lands with their tents and fires. Do you even know how flammable trees are? I had to hide my wife, hide my kids. Please scare them off, Cloudy. You don't need to come and confess. They're looking for you. We're going to find you. You're our only hope. Ribbit. Burn all tents, put out all campfires. A little conflicting. And feed the bear. Okay, well, step one. F 
Feed the bear. That's what I'm thinking of right now. Feed the bear. Now it looks like we're playing uh, a short hop. Now that's a game, man. Just vibing. Just exploring. Just painting the map. How are you going to burn tents with no fire? Can I tell you something? I forgot that lightning is not... Or thunder and lightning are two different things. That's... So I was like, don't worry. I'll just strike the tree with lightning. But I don't have the power of lightning. I have the power of thunder. Ah, never mind. <laughs> Still totally works. Save the forest, though? Save the forest? Okay, don't... I wouldn't worry about the forest, necessarily. Um... Yes, we knew all along, sadly. I don't know, this will be funny. What if you guys, like, get scared? I think I killed him. Oh, he was doing some kind of interview out here. Hello, hello, bear. Oh, he scared the human into the bear. Yeah, yeah, jump. Jump off the freaking... Jump! Just get out of here! Okay. I cannot strike the moon with lightning, unfortunately. Okay, there's the bear. How does one feed the bear? By burning down the forest around him so he can get into the cave behind him. I think we could probably get a, a human all the way up there. Although we did just block... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, you... Hey, hey, yeah, yeah, just push through, just push through. Thank you, thank you, he's strong, man. No, nope, you're in for a world of hurt. Maybe you can scare the... All right. He, he literally doesn't even care. Um, it's a vegetarian bear. You could grow the plant on his right instead. I think that one that one's full, man. Yo. It do it it do be making a skull appear. <laughs> I don't know about all that. Okay, so we still we need to burn the tents. All tents need to be burned. That's not a tent. That's extinguish the campfire. There you go. If we start one and extinguish one, it should count. Oh, you got to push the sheep to the bear. What the heck? This guy's freaking huge, man. I just wanted to see what would happen. Okay. Perhaps... Got him. Um, perhaps we can find a sheep. Here, sheepy, sheepy, sheepy. Just like to do it. It's just fun. Just painting the map. Looking for campfires to extinguish, tents to blow up. Hello, sheepy. I see you. Okay, there's two, two big gets right there. For all the marbles. Dude, he's freaking zooted. No, no, no. No, no. No, no, no. No, no. Dude, this is... It's just like... Herding cats. This is no problem. Yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's freaking schmacking. I stand by my tweet yesterday, by the way. I got some Pyrus booty. The cheddar cheese... was a little underwhelming, honestly. The cheddar cheese rice puff snack, I gotta tell you, it do be schmacking. I found it, I found it positively delicious. There you go, every objective complete. We unlocked Frog Detective. We'll probably play a couple more levels. 
You may have to describe pirate's booty in greater detail. They are corn and rice puffed up almost like a Cheeto, but then um, dusted with a fine layer of white cheddar seasoning. They are delicious. It is good to see you again. It's been much too sunny for much too long. I am glad we will finally get some rain. You know why I love rain so much? Why it helps my plants grow, of course. Rain is just wonderful. In fact, I used to get wet all the time when I was younger. Are you going to say it or should I? But oh my, I have trouble of a different sort today. Maybe you can help? Looks like my sheepy babies have escaped their pen. Would you be a deer and chase them back in? Thanks, sweetie. So true, sweetie. Okay. Excuse, excuse. Just you just gotta scare him. Hey, 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 hey! Don't don't walk into the fire. Dude, this is like the start of Twilight Princess. Okay, you're just, you're screwed. No, 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 you don't get to leave. You stay. You think I don't know anything about Zelda? You think that, that Twilight Princess reference just came out of nowhere? I've played many of the Zeldas. Probably about a quarter. <laughs> there you go, easy. Two stars. We didn't unlock the next level. Bloop, 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 bloop. We did? It was just in the north? Whoops. <laughs> what the heck? Don't boo me! There was no... Oh, there. this was a side level. This was the main level. Okay. You think about everything, don't you? Umbrella City. We call it Scranton. What? The Electric City? Blasted. Okay, time has started. Little two-piece. Little two-piece. Little two-piece. Okay, we got the combos rolling. Got him. Double soak? I have no idea what that is. It's Unicorn Stump. Uh, excuse me. There we go. Keep that combo rolling. Get him, get him. Okay, our combo is out. Just blow up ATMs. Yo, oh, dude. This is your combo generator right here. Godlike. Unstoppable. They got kill streaks in this game. Just lit a dumpster on fire for no reason. Pretty sure that car is gonna explode. Just being a jerk for no reason, really. You thought you could hide from me? What am I raining? I'm raining like dirt on people. Get him, get him, get him. Congratulations, wandering sock, on your on your legitimate score, dude. We got we got the streamer hair too. All right, I got one more level. The office. They put the stapler in Jello. Funniest thing I've ever seen. Unbound Creations presents Dunky Dunk, Dunky Dunk, Dunk, Dunky Dunky Dunk. Uh the cloud. Episode one, wherein the cloud soaks all office workers. Michael Scott. Pam Beasley. That's Jim Halpert, of course. You recognize him by his visage. This would be Dwight K. Schrute. That's Phyllis, Andrew Bernard, and Stanley. This, of course, is the conference room. 
They didn't model the break room properly, but that's okay. This is where uh, Daryl gets his own custom office. Now this gets complicated. I believe this is accounting. So this is Kevin. This is Oscar. And of course, Angela hanging out at her desk. I got to be honest. I don't know what's going on over here. This might be Creed and Meredith. Creed and Meredith over here. I think I've done it. Where, where's my, my prize? Oh, they did model the break room. I just can't get in there. 100% correct. What can I say? Toby's in the annex. Toby works for corporate, so he technically he's not a part of our family. Also, he's divorced, so technically he's not a part of his own family either. I'm going to free this stapler. Oh, hello. Can I get an outfit rating for today? Wow, horizontal stripes. That's very brave, baby. Kate, you remember the office? Yeah. This is the office. Oh, it is the office. Okay, you ready? Here's your quiz. I'm gonna I'm gonna restart the level. This will be great content. Just give it one moment here. Who's this? David. The boss. The boss. <laughs> That's not his name. Ma. Michael. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who sits here? Uh, the the husband. Josh. This is Josh's seat, and of course. That's his wife. I know Catherine. Josh and Catherine, the fa <laughs> the famous will they or won't they of the office, Josh and Catherine. Um, and then of course everybody knows who sits here. That's that's Mouth, also known as Dwight Schrute. The, the account lady. Account lady? Okay. She likes cats. That is, Dwight's uh, girlfriend. This is Dwight's girlfriend, Stanley. And, no, 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 no. I was going on about the account lady for... That was oh, the okay. <laughs> the Stan, I know Stanley. Did he, I he stutter? He cross, crosswords puzzles. That's correct. He does crossword puzzles. What's going on over here, though? Who sits here? Oh, he hates working. He's, he's a freebie. He's a freebie who hates working. That's that's the intern. That's where Ryan sits. Okay. And then. That's the guy who toppled over the pot of pasta sauce. <laughs> that's the, the pot of pasta sauce. <laughs> that's Kevin. Okay. All right. And then who's who's over here? There's no one there. No one sits here in the office. And then what about this? Oh, later season, he was working in the warehouse. But then he comes up and he's like, he got full of good ideas. It's absolutely correct. We watched like all the seasons. It, like seven seasons of and that show. The other room. We, we can't go through there, unfortunately. No. Oh, that's the cafeteria. <laughs> and then after that, there's the lady who likes to get laid. Oh, Meredith. Yeah. <laughs> hey, baby. Baby, are you excited for our walk later? It's supposed to be like the last non-rainy day for a while. And then it's like rain for like a whole, whole week. I looked at the weather report yesterday. I was laughing because it's like tomorrow sunny, and then literally for like nine days in a row, it's like it's gonna rain. There you go. How much did I get right? Uh. I think one. Oh, we might we might move to the other part of the office now. Oh, oh, hey, watch out there. Oh, I got coffee. Oh, that's, I mean, come on. It's the guy, he's the H HR. Hey, Michael. Michael, you can't bring Thomas? Toby. Toby. I don't even, I don't, I don't know this. Oh, it's the break room. And that's where the Kelly was like, oh, my God, I'm going to give birth. And then she's like, no, we have to wait until, like, Friday. So oh, it's not, oh, not Catherine anymore. Now it's Kelly. Oh, wait, that's what I said. Who is actually Pam. Oh, Pam. <laughs> <laughs> Fill all mugs Whoa! with fresh coffee. Okay. 
Michael, you can't bring a static firing anti-aircraft missile into the office. I hate so much about the things you choose to be. That mug says number one boss. I believe it does say world's greatest boss. Is that the putting of the stapler? Mm -hmm. Which is the first episode it, of the first season? She's she's right on that one. A squammy demi do me do me squam. Who's the Pam's boyfriend? Jim. 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 Big I tuna. Was, I'm so good. Jim, J Josh, you know. We're in the... Oh, Kate! It's the, it's the chili episode. Oh, he's got a tuple with mm -hmm. a pot of chili. Look at him, he's going. There he goes. And I said, why is this funny? <laughs> <laughs> I think he just died. Where the cloud starts a fire. Dude, this show's full of references. Oh, yeah, that's the Dwight started the fire. Uh, excuse me, Ryan started the fire? You gotta put your cheese cheese pita in the uh, in the microwave for too long. I thought Dwight started the fire and then he locked everyone in. Oh, that's the, yeah, that's the fire drill episode. You got that one. Yeah. And then people are like, that's fucked up, Dwight. You can't do that. And like, I won't try to teach you just in case if it actually happens. <laughs> What if, what if I could be Prison Mike? In prison, you are somebody's biatch. You really expect us to believe you're a different person? You really expect me not to push you up against the wall? I don't know, man. Let's just start raining. In, the, in that uh, break room, they hold the... Uh Secret club society. Oh, the the party planning committee? No, no, no. Only the cool kids can come in, and then they they can have like a fancy cheese. <laughs> oh, I, yeah. Okay, I remembered. I remember now. All right, this is a little violent. It's Dwight's first day. Yeah, you should just lighten lighten everybody up. Finer Things Club. That's oh, the Finer Things Club. <laughs> They're all gonna die. They, I saved your life. The end. To be continued. <laughs> He's done. Complete the office. We got the world's best boss hat. Did you see? Yeah. World's, world's best cloud. Well, that is... um. That has rain on your parade. It's a nifty little game. Also, yeah, they should work on their fire alarm drill because that it took the alarm like 45 seconds to go off. Um, rain on your parade. That was a fun little bit of variety. I'm going to go hit the bathroom up real quick and then I'm going to come back and I'm going to do some typing tests. <laughs> I want to I wanna test myself in type racer, okay? But uh, for now, thanks for watching. I'm going to go to the bathroom and... Uh, then we will uh, do some type racer. See you then.